my name is Jennifer Madrill, and I'm the founder and executive director of Designers for Learning. We're a 501c3 nonprofit with a mission to give people opportunities to gain experience while at the same time helping underserved educational needs. In other words, we're giving people the opportunity to gain experience for good. We welcome you to our Design in the Open Challenge, a unique professional development opportunity we're offering to explore ways to cultivate your professional presence in your chosen field. At Designers for Learning, we firmly believe that getting a job is far more than creating artifacts that you can share in your resume or on a portfolio. Beyond taking the right coursework and knowing the latest tools and technologies, we believe it's necessary to spend time, frankly a lot of time, cultivating a professional presence within your chosen field. The focus of this course is squarely on contemplating various perspectives about how to engage in a reflexive and open work process as a means of developing your professional presence. Within the contact form on our website, we ask, please describe your interest in Designers for Learning. Several hundred people have responded to this prompt as they share their contact information with us. Again and again, respondents note that they're looking to gain experience to get a new job or transition into a different job within their current field. Many have advanced degrees, but they're having trouble getting their foot in the door with a new employer or securing the type of work they want because they don't feel they have enough experience or don't know the right people. When developing this course, we were inspired by a book titled Show Your Work, 10 Ways to Share Your Creativity and Get Discovered by Austin Kleon. In the book's introduction, Kleon writes that his readers are those trying to break into a new creative field. He's often asked, how do I get myself out there? How do I get noticed? How do I find an audience? Kleon's response is one we applaud and try to emulate in our own work. Kleon suggests, in order to be found, you have to be findable. I think there's an easy way of putting your work out there and making it discoverable while you're focused on getting really good at what you do. From Cleon's perspective, those who are successful don't hoard their work in secrecy, but instead, they gain an audience by sharing what they're doing as they're doing it. This philosophy of openly sharing is the foundation of Designers for Learning's approach to design, as well as our central recommendation to the professional development of designers. The primary reason we're so drawn to Cleon's message in Show Your Work is he doesn't focus on self-promotion as an end to get a job or to sell a product, but rather the goal is to develop a transparent and reflexive professional growth process that helps you to think about your work as you share it and naturally attract others. As Cleon notes in the introduction to his book, the aim is to be so good they can't ignore you. So at this point you might be asking, what will you do during this professional development experience? This design in the Open Challenge is offered as part of a 100% self-paced independent study course. Each of the five sections in the course focuses on a different theme related to developing your professional presence. Recorded interviews highlight various perspectives related to each section's theme. Within self-guided exercises, you'll engage in a variety of design in the Open Challenges geared toward your own professional presence development, and you'll have the opportunity to share and compare your impressions of each section's theme with others in the course. As this is a 100% self-paced course, you can spend as much time as you want working on the materials and completing the design in the open challenges. To benefit from the experience, you should plan to spend at least 15 hours working on the material. That works out to be about three hours for each of the five sections in the course. However, like most experiences in life, the worth is related to the time and effort committed to it. To learn more about the design in the open challenge and how to contact us, head to our website at designersforlearning.org slash opendesign. Thank you for your interest in our work, and we look forward to seeing you in the course.